The most compelling story in the world involves a 14-year-old girl fighting for her life. She held up the light against the darkness of ignorance, and now millions around the world are watching to see if she will die for her cause. Malala Yousafzai was taken on Monday to a British hospital for treatment of a gunshot wound to the head. A week ago in Pakistan, the Taliban gunman climbed aboard her school bus to assassinate her because of her long campaign to open schools to more girls in that country. Doctors are thank you for trying verbose. This recording will go away once the product has been purchased. Just beginning to examine Yousafzai, and there's hope she'll make what doctors called a decent recovery, although her treatment and rehabilitation could take months. Yousafzai was blown out of Pakistan in a specially equipped air ambulance. She arrived this afternoon at the Queen Elizabeth Hospital in Birmingham, the state-of-the-art medical center that specializes in the treatment of serious traumas like head injuries and severe gunshot wounds. The hospital has treated thousands of injured soldiers from Afghanistan. Dr. Dave Rosser was part of the reason why Yusuf Zai was blown there. Thank you for trying verbose. This recording will go away once the product has been purchased. We are the receiving hospital for the British battle casualties and have been for the last 10 years, he said. We do unfortunately have very extensive experience with this sort of traumatic injury. Yusuf Zai flew there without any family, but CBS News was told that her parents left Pakistan on Monday evening and expected to arrive Tuesday morning.